Here is Israel. So I joined the army. I grew up in uh, Oakland, California. So, you know, that's a hear all kinds of different opinions on what happens in the Middle East and what we should, you know, what America should do about the Middle East and how people should think about what's going on in the Middle East. Uh, for example, we used to have weekly protests by women in black down my street every Saturday as I walked to synagogue. Uh, so, you know, I've always had people yelling at me about what I should think about Israel. I wasn't able to really form my own opinion until I got here. And I think it's really important that people don't listen to what other people tell them to think about what's going on in the Middle East or about any problem in general, but specifically about what's happening in the Middle East and how the army interacts with people until really they've experienced it with them, you know, by themselves. And so that's why I think it's so important for uh, people to come here and really view for themselves firsthand. That way they can make their own decisions instead of having people yell at them from all different angles and telling them about this kind of violation of human rights and this violation of human rights because it's really it's taken out of context, not true, and to be honest it's just people trying to influence their own ideals on you. And that's why it's so important that you come here, visit, make your own opinions, and then you can go back and, and uh, listen to all these very, very opinionated people and really come to your own decisions. Four years ago I came to Israel on a trip with a summer program and I pretty much threw everything away that I had in America to come here and visit. And I came to Hebron and I saw little kids playing in fear and watching soldiers look after them as they play. And I knew that this was the time that I had to make a decision to come to Israel and help. Everything you see on the internet, everything that's talked about Israel, it's an occupation. It's it's, uh, what's that word? What's, yo, South Africa, what's it called? Apartheid. Apartheid. <laughs> it's apartheid. It's, it's all bullshit. It's not, it's not real. You guys gotta come here by yourselves and check it out because you can't, you gotta know two sides of the situation to start judging it. That's it. I left America. I left everything. I left my car. I left my friends. I left my girl. I left. Fo I left a football scholarship. I, now I'm here serving the IDF. I'm doing what I think is right. Gotta do what you gotta do. That's it. Here is Israel.